So, uh, yeah. Hey guys, uh, this is probably gonna go up on YouTube. Um, I'm gonna try and make this brief while I'm doing this, uh, this loop. Um, fuck the Lich King boss. Just fuck it. Like, I actually hate it. So, the interesting thing about it is that there, there's a bunch of different exploits that people are doing with, like, Keltazad or whatever. And while that's all well and good, uh, I don't have Keltazad. But you know what I do have? I happen to pull a copy of Bring It On out of uh, my pack openings for uh, Knights of the Frozen Throne. And the nice thing about Bring It On is it's two mana gain 10 armor. Uh, so, because it's gain 10 and not like gain 5 like Iron Hide is, uh, you can actually make it to where the amount of health that you gain from, uh, from the armor up and from Bring It On will actually completely, uh, overtake, uh, Lich King's damage output, which... If you brawl after he plays Frostmourne, will be 7. And so, over the course of 2 turns, he deals 14 damage. But over the course of 2 turns, uh, 1 turn you play... Oh god. Oh wait, no, 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 no. This is fine, this is fine. Okay, I almost, I almost fucked it up the whole thing. I've been grinding this shit for hours, so I'm like super uh, on edge right now. But anyway, so... Uh, you get 14 health over 2 turns... And he deals 14 health over two turns, so you can't die. Uh, you have to be, like, really careful about uh, not fucking up. Because you need to have a draw card, preferably a spell, because, typically speaking, the minions that draw you cards, like Cold Light Oracle, the AI will make his 2-6 attack into the Cold Light Oracle. I'm not about that life. Uh, so instead, um, I'm opting for either Battle Rage or Commanding Shout is actually a card that I teched into the deck as well. Uh, and you might be thinking to yourself, what the hell, like, I, I really, really, really hope that this game does not have, or that, uh, Solo Adventures don't have the 45 turn timer. Because if it does, I don't know how I'm gonna beat him. I straight up do not know how I'm going to beat the Lich King. Like, at this point, the order doesn't really matter just so long as I uh, make sure that I have one Commanding Shout, one uh, Bring It On available in, like, the cache or whatever. Like, in my total deck. Um, okay. So now I can just armor up here, pass, draw the second Dead Man's Hand, and then do the same loop again. So he's going to keep taking Fatigue damage. And I have... The important thing to keep in mind is... I have two charges on my Fiery War Axe, which means I can swing at his minion twice once he's about to take 160 fatigue damage, technically 157, whatever works, um, and then that'll do it, or that should do it, I hope, I hope to god, um, yeah, so this should work. Supposedly. Again, this is all... This all... Uh, this all depends on whether or not there is a turn timer in Solo Adventure. If there is, then I'm fucked. I'm just, I'm just right fucked. And this is going to be a very long and painful experience of just not winning. Like, Warrior is the one class that I haven't been able to beat Lich King with. And that's it. I just... I'm... I am pained... With that fact, it is a burden. Okay. So yeah, my commentary for this is going to be a little scattered, just because, again, I have to focus. Obviously, it's a lot faster if you can somehow pull off the Cold Light Oracles, but again, for some reason, I'm not getting it consistent enough to where they don't get, like, the Cold Lights don't get 
uh, whacked by the 2-6. They should be getting whacked by his weapon instead, but it's not doing that. Uh, and I have no idea why it's not doing that. So God knows how this will actually work out, assuming it works out even at all. Which, again, I really, really, really hope it does, because I want Arthas so bad! Arthas is so fucking cool! Alright. It's at this point in the video where uh, I will probably cut ahead uh, to my inevitable success or failure. No! Are you fucking kidding me? Blizzard. Come on. I was guaranteed to fucking win that game. If I hadn't, like, if I didn't do some sort of input ma screw up. I was guaranteed to win that if the turn timer didn't exist I like I know why the timers there to prevent from like bots and shit from clogging your damn servers but what the fuck god fucking damn it whatever it doesn't fucking matter because I can't fucking do it, so whatever. Damn it! I tried so hard.